Whether it embraces the entire nation or focuses on a single community, preservation happens when a leader with vision steps forward and takes action. In 1980, a young man named Mark Michael became the first president of a new organization he had helped create, the Archaeological Conservancy. In the 28 years since then, Michael's energetic leadership has built the Conservancy into a national organization with a strong and supportive constituency of more than 23,000 members. Today, an expansive range of tours and educational events allows members to learn more about ancient cultures, and a popular quarterly magazine informs the public about the wide range of threats that put sites at risk. Equally important, the Conservancy has earned the respect of funders, and their support enables the organization to move quickly to save archaeological sites that are in danger of being lost to vandalism, development, or the ravages of time and weather. Over the years, the Conservancy has acquired and preserved some 365 endangered sites from California to New England. That kind of success doesn't just happen. It is the product of leadership, the leadership of Mark Michael, a man with an unswerving determination to protect America's precious and fragile legacy from the past. The same determination drove Jane Blaffer Owen to launch an ambitious and successful effort to preserve and revitalize the historic Indiana town of New Harmony, which was established as a utopian settlement by her husband's great-great-grandfather. From the moment she first saw it in 1941, Jane Owen fell in love with the place, and she immediately went to work to transform the tiny, long-neglected town into a major cultural center and visitor attraction. Personally, or through the Robert Lee Blaffer Foundation, which she founded, she has rehabbed numerous historic buildings and created an extraordinary array of artworks and gardens. She has commissioned widely acclaimed contemporary buildings from modern-day masters, such as Philip Johnson and Richard Meyer. She was the driving force behind the construction of the New Harmony Inn, establishing heritage tourism as an economic engine in the town, long before the term heritage tourism was on everyone's lips. After six decades of innovative and exemplary preservation effort, she's earned the right to rest on her laurels. But today, Jane Blaffer Owen still talks about things she wants to do next year in New Harmony. Vision, action, leadership. Add them all together, as Mark Michael and Jane Blaffer Owen have done so expertly, and the results are clear and inspiring. People who care, people who lead, are the key to success in the all-important work of saving the places that matter.